Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. United Airlines gives free flights to illegal aliens. Flying is becoming more problematic for travelers these days as costs and waiting times increase. United Airlines has seen more than their share of bad publicity over various events. It's not cheap to fly the friendly skies anymore either. Take for instance if you are thinking of traveling from Houston, Texas to Phoenix, Arizona on United Airlines tomorrow. Your ticket will probably cost you over $1,000 and that does not include insurance and change fees. It's why discount airlines are doing so well these days and in fact, it's why many people just choose not to fly unless they have to. Between costs, inconvenience and the TSA, Flying just isn't what it used to be. If you are an illegal alien, it's a different story. You can fly for free. That's right. If you are breaking the rule of law, United Airlines will give you free passage. They are providing complimentary flights to illegal alien families who are separated when they cross the border. United Airlines has partnered up with FWD.us. They are an advocacy group that is known for defending illegal immigrant rights. The deal was announced Wednesday. Funny. I don't remember sweet deals like this for our military or for Americans period. Go figure. The San Francisco Business Times reported Thursday that the pro-immigration lobbying group FWD.us announced United's donation in a Facebook post, calling it needed, timely, and critical. They thanked United Airlines for joining the Flights for Families campaign. Ostensibly, this campaign is meant to reunite children with their parents after being separated for illegal vetting on the border. United couldn't wait to post a comment on Facebook saying how proud they are to be flying people for free who have broken the rule of law to illegally sneak across our border. They are just proud as punch to support FWD.us and their work to help reunify immigrant children and families. That could very well alienate a bunch of potential customers. A growing community of support is coming together to reunite families who are separated at the border. We are so thankful and happy to announce that United Airlines is jumping in and helping, FWD.us statement read. Thanks to this partnership with United, we are able to provide travel to the recently reunited immigrant families to get to their next destination with dignity. United replied by saying, Our company's shared purpose is to connect people and unite the world. We are proud to support your work and help reunify immigrant children and families. MM. The Refugee and Immigrant Center for Education and Legal Services, RAISES, also announced Tuesday that it would donate $3 million toward its Flights for Families project. RAISES one of the groups working to reunite families at the border, said in the announcement that it would work with FWD.us and families belong together on the initiative. FWD.us was founded by Microsoft's Bill Gates, Facebook's Mark Zuckerberg and Dropbox's Drew Houston. Frankly, I'm not sure as a business it is wise for United to insert themselves into the middle of the immigration battle. Either way they go, they upset people. It speaks of not supporting President Trump's agenda on the border, the rule of law and law enforcement. That's not great PR for the airline if you ask me. You let illegal aliens fly for free and give the military an extra bag for free. That doesn't sound right or fair to me. A recent CBS poll does show that most Americans want children kept with their parents who illegally enter the country. But the catch is, they also want them detained or deported as a family after they are caught crossing the border into America. Only 21% want illegal aliens and their children released onto America's streets. 48% say that the government should release the entire family back to their home country together. I agree with that sentiment. 11% of Americans believe that the parents should be arrested, but have their children kept with them in the same facility. Remember, United and Delta both scrapped discounts for NRA members recently. Priorities prevail and it's easy to see where their loyalties truly lie. United also told federal officials in June it wants no part in President Trump's zero-tolerance immigration policy and therefore will not transport illegal immigrant children whose parents are detained. Based on our serious concerns about this policy and how it's in deep conflict with our company's values, we have contacted federal officials to inform them that they should not transport immigrant children on United aircraft who have been separated from their parents, a statement read from United CEO Oscar Munoz. This policy and its impact on thousands of children is in deep conflict with that mission and we want no part of it, Munoz added. This was just the next step for United Airlines. Wonder how they will identify those claiming a free flight? Seems to me that United Airlines is more concerned with social justice these days than customer service. Needless to say, I won't be flying United Airlines anytime in the near future or ever again for that matter. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click, like, and subscribe. 
Thank you.